What is up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have sort of a chill video, okay? We're gonna be going around the island, doing our daily tasks. Uh, we have a few things that I need to get to today. We have someone brand new living on the island. We're gonna be talking about the update, some thoughts, and uh, one thing I think no one else is talking about. So we're gonna get into that. And uh, I don't know, I'm, I'm, I might be starting these kind of like day in the life type videos where it's just like we're interacting with villagers. We might be doing some designing, kind of like some low key stuff. So let me know in the comments after you watch this, if you like this style, maybe you want more, I don't know. Let's get going today. I haven't even done anything. It's early, it's kind of early in the early in the day. Uh, I haven't even checked my mail. So let's do that, let's see what we got. Lots of mail, right? no. <laughs> one, one letter guy, I need some friends to send me some things, okay? But Fauna came through. Let's see what Fauna has to say. Giving a gift in person can feel so casual. Sending this item via snail mail seemed more appropriate somehow. What's more charming than a well-wrapped package? The hand-picked gift inside. Okay, let's see what Fauna thought was so charming. All right, let's, uh, let's see what Fauna... Me and Fauna are pretty cool, right? Uh, I gave Fauna the man of her dreams in Eric, and uh, so this better be good. Let's see what this is. Paw slippers. <laughs> um, I hate those. I hate those. Okay, anyway, uh, let's see, you know, what NPC we have. We have to give out gifts, guys. So, one of the things that I'm doing right now is I'm trying to get all my villager photos, okay? I just got Eric's the other day. I almost cried. It was fantastic. I got pecans the other day. And I I mean, a lot of people know this, but for those, of, for those of you who don't. So essentially, if you are getting your fossils throughout the day and you assess them and then you put them in wrapping paper, that's like the best gift you can give. That's like, villagers love that. So I guess, I guess we'll go and uh, get these assessed and give them out as gifts. Okay, we have all the fossils assessed. So basically what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna wrap all these. We're trying to get, we're trying to get Lucky's picture. We're trying to get Kiki's picture before Halloween. That's the goal. Cause I, I definitely wanna like display them somewhere. I think that'd be really cute. I have their posters, but I want their pictures. Okay, so we gotta find those two hooligans and uh, let's see what's going on in the plaza. Usually this is the place to be. Possibly an NPC here, no. But we have our first villager, Bunny. I love Bunny so much, okay. Good morning, Teehee, oh, I love that little thing, okay. Uh, okay, you're gonna get a fossil because I want your picture too. I can't believe I didn't mention you, here you go. Oh, and Kiki's in the background. All right. You're gonna sing while you open it. There you go, exactly what you wanted, a old, Dinosaur relic. All right, let's see what I get back. Oh, no, no picture yet. Bunny's kind of new on my island, so a baseball uniform in the fall. I mean, the playoffs are coming. Go Rays. But uh, yeah, Kiki, my girl Kiki. How are things, Kitty Cat? Another great, another great uh, saying right there. Okay, we're gonna give you one. Will we get a picture? Will we finally get the picture? All right, mind if I open it up? No problem. There you go. There's that ancient fossil you asked for. And I want the picture. Come on. I did not a, I did not want a wall, Kiki. Okay, well, any, you're still cute. You're great. Everyone should have Kiki, at least for the Halloween time, right? Now I gotta find Lucky. There's no one here. All right, let's go find Lucky. Oh, we got a lost item here. Okay, let's see who this belongs to. So we got a lost item. Now I do like this color. So a lot of, uh, I wouldn't say a lot, but some people keep these items and kind of decorate with them, especially like the maroon ones. All right, I'm gonna try and guess which villager this belongs to without getting the hint. Because if you talk to a villager, obviously they tell you. And then we still have to meet the brand new villager, guys. Don't forget about that. I have mixed opinions. I actually swiped this villager in. I have their uh, amiibo card. All right, you know what? I'm gonna ask Bunny 
who uh, who she thinks this belongs to. I feel like Bunny is kind of the mom of uh, Corneria right now. She's uh, sweeping in the plaza. Yeah, she'll definitely know. Super great to see you. I love you, Bunny. Uh, did you drop something? Is this yours? Here you go. This uh, maroon journal. Let's see. Did I get it right? It's not mine. It's Fauna. Okay. So it belongs to Fauna. So we have to thank Fauna for the mail anyway. No one ever sends me mail anymore. And I get to do her a favor by bringing her her journal back. Which obviously has a bunch of uh, love stories about Eric taking her out near the fishing pond and things like that. So as much as I want to read it, obviously we have to kind of, you know... We have to respect the privacy, okay? Okay, let's go see Fauna. I might be passing the new villager. We might be meeting my new villager for the first time. I think we should actually look for them. I want to know from you guys, do you like this villager? All right, let's just go. Let's just go. Um, go to Fauna. I don't see them yet. Their house is over here. Let's see if we can play this game. Do you guys know what villager this is just by the house? Maybe you're like Animal Crossing experts and you don't even need to, uh, you don't even need to see the villager, you know, by the house. Hello, Fauna. I regret giving you this eel every single day of my life, but uh, you did drop something. Come here. Look at that little floral dress. It's, you look very beautiful, Fauna. However, it's fall time, okay? So you need to be getting some plaid, perhaps. I guess that's my job to give you clothes, but uh, I believe you lost this. Let's see what reward I get. I mean, you, you, your gift giving abilities, like the paw slippers, it's not that great so far. I did find your book, okay. Thank you for going out of your way to bring this back. I want to give you a little something in return. More clothes, a sweatshirt. This could be good. This could be a good sweatshirt. And you know what? I might gift this to her. So let's check this out. Ooh. You know what? I think Fauna would look good in that. Now they do do dialogue. Oh, you sat down, you son of a gun. Well, I'll be back to give you the sweatshirt. Let's go meet that new villager. Let's go down here. We got Grizzly. Grizzly is in his house. Oh, and Lucky's here. Okay, I have to see Lucky. Because we need to give him the fossil and hopefully get Lucky's picture. Hello, Lucky, you spooky little dog. Okay, morning. Having a friend come say hi is a real neat start to the day. Okay, if I'm waking up and a friend is knocking on my door, I'm a little bit annoyed. So uh, I don't share that sentiment, but here you go. Here's your fossil. You're a freak. You like bones. You like weird things. So maybe give me your picture. Open it up. There's that pelvis you ordered. <laughs> okay, I want the picture. Sleeved apron. That's that's what I asked for next. All right, Lucky, I'll see you tomorrow. Get ready, take some selfies. Give me that picture, get it ready. Okay, I still don't see this new villager. Oh, the new villager is right down here. Okay. Let's go talk to him. Ward Jr. The, the, <laughs> I don't know. Okay, if you ask me like six months ago, I would say, Future Pat, you're weird. Frogs are disgusting. Ward Jr. kind of has this vibe going on. First time we're running into each other. Much obliged for the encouragement you gave me to move here from the campsite. Yes, I did swipe Ward Jr. in. You really did me a solid. Thanks a bunch, neighbor. Man. Look at Ward Jr. Look at those like uh, little shifty eyes. He's wearing a silk robe. Is Ward Jr. trying to be my friend or is he trying to seduce me? I think it's working. Look at Ward Jr. Ward Jr. is pretty cute. Uh, have you ever been over to visit Stitch's place? Ward Jr., how dare you? You've been here for about a day. St me and Stitch's are homies, okay? Of course I've been to Stitch's house. It's not for me to say, but I'm sure glad I don't live there. 
Ward Jr. causing problems on day one. Jeez. Let me know in the comments what you think about Ward Jr. I think he's okay. Kind of looks like a hamburger bun, you know? Little seeds on his face. He's not bad. Does he laugh? No, he doesn't. He's a grouch. All right, so obviously the update came out and uh, in the update trailer, which I may or may not have watched 20,000 times, uh, they said we are officially getting pumpkins. You know me, guys. I'm always ahead of the curve. I already had a pumpkin patch, okay? Now, the crops that I'm growing are hats, which that's not a good crop. You can't really eat hats. So I have a pretty easy transition to just like take the hats out and I feel like I'm good. Um, I was talking to a lot of people about what they thought of pumpkins and farming coming into Animal Crossing. It's mostly positive. Now, one thing I want to talk about, I haven't really heard a lot, is like in the trailer, you can kind of see the character watering the pumpkins and the pumpkins kind of uh, sparkling like flowers. I'm wondering if orange pumpkins are the only pumpkins that we can grow, but if we water them and they sparkle, they can then grow hybrids, which are then like the white pumpkins or yellow pumpkins. Either way, that was the easiest transition ever. I'm actually thinking of extending this out a bit. So I'm thinking of making this patch even bigger. I don't want to do all that work today, but uh, I am ready for pumpkins. We got an empty pumpkin patch and uh, I cannot wait to grow some pumpkins. All right, my favorite part of the day is checking what Nook's Cranny has in stock. Now, let's just guess. Let's guess what they're going to have. I'm going to say the big item is going to be a bathtub and uh, they're going to have a book. Okay, I actually need books. So let's check it out. Let's see what Nook's Cranny has. Maybe there's a villager in there. Okay, okay, no bathtub, no book. But there's some, there's some interesting items here. Flamingo, I don't even want to see you, okay? This is fall. You've had your time to shine. The pet bed's pretty cool. I already have pet bed, though. Uh, you can actually customize the cushion to make a little pet in there. It looks pretty cool. Uh, I have all these items. I'm not really surprised, though. I'm not really surprised. Do I need any tools? I feel like I have everything. Yeah. I feel like I'm good. What's my turnip prices? My turnip prices are never good, okay? 58. There we go. There, I think the highest that I've ever seen in my Nook's Cranny is about 130. So no one ever asks me, no one ever DMs me saying, hey, Pat, what's your turnip price? Because they know Corneria is trash uh, when it comes to economics. Okay. All right. So Nook's Cranny, you know, nothing crazy. I don't really check Abel's much. You know, I don't really buy a lot of clothes. Oh, God. Eric. Every time I see Eric, guys, he's just great. He looks so cute, man. He's fishing. I want all of your attention, Eric. So I, um, can I just push you away? Okay, good. Eric, we need to talk. Hey, best friend. I didn't even tell him to say that. I was just thinking about how I wanted to see you. Oh my God, Eric. Of course you want to see me. See, like he's a real friend, okay? Um, What am I going to give you? I already have your picture. Let's just give you another. We want to be as, as best friends as possible, guys. There you go, Eric. Enjoy that skull. All right. An eggshell. Oh, that's the hat. Okay, I was like, wait, you're giving me garbage, Eric? Go back to your fishing. Everyone loves you. Vote Eric 2020. Let's make you the best villager. I can't quite find the message in a bottle. Oh, God. Okay. Is this still recording? Is this still recording? I have seen Gullivar maybe three times ever since he came out. Okay, let's let's pick this up. Gullivar, you son of a gun. Why don't you ever come to my island? Raise the mainsail. Ready the yard sail. I love his little gibberish. Get up. Gullivar, get up. Okay, there we go. Hey, Gulliver, how you, how you doing? Why didn't they just call you Gulliver? Um, okay, I'm assuming you lost your phone again. You have like a serious, like he's always on a bender when you see him, okay? All right, so now we have to uh, go dive for his communicator. Which I love this minigame. It's something to do. 
Trusty communicator is gone and vanished. All right, we'll get it for you, man. We'll get it. Only if you promise to give me a cool pirate item that I don't already have, all right? All right, I'll look for the communicator. It's probably nearby anyway. All right, nearby. We got to dive for it. I'm going to try to do it in the first the first attempt, all right? Let's put on this. Okay. Nice form on there. It has to be close by. If this is it, this might be it, honestly. I haven't dove in so long, guys. I need a reason. No. Hey, it's me, Patrick. Okay. Let's keep going. Got to find that cell phone. Man, it might... It must be in a, like a life-proof case. I don't know how it works after being submerged in water. But anyway. All right, we got some more bubbles here. Let's go get this bad boy. There it is. There's the communicator. All right, here we go. Let's bring this back to Gullivar. I kind of wish that... Uh, like, when you see Gullivar, the communicator was, like, broken into parts. I guess that wouldn't make sense, though, because it's, like, in, it's in water. I wish there was more to this quest. But, you know what? You see Gulliver in a pirate costume. It's not that bad. All right, here you go, man. Here's your phone. You really should get some insurance on it, possibly. Okay. Call your boys. Tell them to come back. Uh, Gullivar will be sending me the prize tomorrow, so unfortunately in this video we can't see it. Okay. Thank you very much. I will see you never. I really should, like, take pictures with you and stuff, because I'm never going to see you again. But... Alright. There you go. Alright, well that was fun. Oh, we have Stitches over here! Stitches is the homie. What's up, man? I always dig running into you, boo-boo. <laughs> How's things? It's great. Let's talk first. I don't want to just give you a gift and run away. I overslept a little bit today, but that's cool. It gave the bugs in my house some extra quiet time. Do you need money? Do you need me to help you out, Stitches? If you're going through something, let me know. Okay, anyway. Let's give you something. What do you need? I kind of want to give... I kind of want to give Stitches the sweatshirt that Fauna gave us. Is that wrong? Does that mean green might look good on you? Okay, here you go. Please look good on Stitches. All right, put this on, man. I heard you were having some money problems. Oh, look at that. Stitches looks pretty cute in that. That's a nice fall makeover for Stitches. Kind of, you know, more serious. That's nice. I like that. All right. Oh, here's another thing, guys. I just replaced this bridge which means the patterns are all messed up. So I got to fix the patterns on here. It's not going to be too hard, but uh, I used to have like the suspension bridge, kind of like the one that goes down, has the handles on the side. I feel like that kind of looks a little bit too tropical for my island. So I definitely wanted to replace this and uh, get more of like a woodsy type thing. So let's kind of let's fix this here. I love how you can put patterns under the bridge, by the way. Man, if you couldn't do that, that would be... That'd be terrible. Okay, let's put this here. Bada bing, it's already fixed. And then two more over here. I think I've replaced pretty much all the bridges that I've... Oh wait, ooh, 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 ooh. Oh wait, this one goes here. Beautiful, okay. This one's a little bit, a little bit thicker on this side. Okay. Oh my god, I hate doing that. The path, once you have it down, it's fantastic, right? It's the best thing in the world. But just figuring out which pieces go where, oh my god. Okay, let's put this here. Let's put a middle one. I don't think it matters. There we go. Good as new. All right, I got to see some of my other villagers. Uh, give them some gifts, see how they're doing. Oh wait, Grizzly? I don't have Grizzly's picture yet. Let me go get some fossils. Then I'll be right back. We'll give some more gifts and uh, see if we can get some photos. All right, we got all the fossils. We got them assessed. We got the wrapping paper. Uh, it's time to find some more villagers. Guys, I really want the photos. Before, I wasn't even concerned about the photos. But now I want them. I want them all. Kiki's just hanging out. Okay, good stuff. I believe we have Grizzly 
and Pecan. But I haven't seen, I already have Pecan's photo. So, uh, yeah, Pecan's in there. We already have her photo. She might be crafting something. Let's go down and see Grizzly. Grizzly's still home. I love his house, by the way. Let's go check out, see what he's up to. Grizzly, what's up, man? I actually gave you this net the other day. I'm glad, I'm glad that you still have it. You didn't sell it. Uh, Grizzly is like my spirit animal, okay? Cranky, wears plaid, and loves campsites. His house is a campsite, okay? So let's give, uh, Grizzly. Grizzly, come in. Hey, what do you, what do you? Okay, Grizzly, here you go. Glad you can make it. I like Grizzly, another cranky villager. Him and Wart Jr. are now two crankies in here. Um, I do have something to give you. Oh, wait, I didn't. Oh, this is always awkward when you have to get out. I changed my mind. No, I, no, I have the gifts. All right, let's wrap these. I'm so sorry. You know, last minute wrapping. You're not seeing anything. Okay, let's do this. All right, now, now I can give you stuff. My guy, how's it going? Let's restart this. Okay, I do have something. Here you go. Here you go, man. Am I gonna get the picture? Might as well get to unwrapping. All right, come on. Splendorifus Relic. All right, old school jacket. Oh my God. Well, I mean, your, your fashion sense is impeccable. So this might be good. Let's wear this. Absolutely not. I regret putting that on. Okay, I have way too many items. I gotta get rid of some items. All right, now, oh, Ward Jr. Look at Ward Jr., guys. He's kind of, he's growing on me, guys. Little cute guy. He's cute. He always looks like he's up to something or he's just constantly judging things. Mood. But uh, I don't know. I kind of like him. So I think the only villager left that we could possibly get their photo is Maple. Maple's the last one left. It all, it all, it's all on Maple's shoulders right now. Will we get the photo? I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. Let's, uh, let's go talk to Maple, see what she's up to. Where is she? Oh, she's right. Oh my God. You're to you're so tiny, Maple. Maple. Maple is lifting weights. I love you. Okay, Maple, stop being so cute. It's so nice to see you first thing in the morning. Man, a lot of, I have like a lot of morning villagers. Okay, here's a gift. And uh, if you want to give me your picture, you can. All right, there you go. You can, you can lift that for a weight. That's probably heavier than what you're doing. Bicycle helmet. Not what I wanted, but you're still cute. You're really cute actually. All right guys, so we gave out some gifts. We met Wart Jr. Let me know in the comment section if you like Wart Jr. Do you like the frogs in general? Who's your favorite frog? I don't know, I think I'll be keeping him around for a little bit at least. We'll see how he adjusts to the, to the island life here. Uh, anyway guys, let me know what you think about these like day in the life type videos. They're chill, they're a little bit longer than normal. Uh, but I may, I might do more of these, you know, some, maybe I'll include more decorating elements into some and, uh, yeah, see how this does. And, uh, thank you guys very much for watching again. I'll see you in the very next video tomorrow night. We're actually going to be playing the Halloween update for the first time. I'll be live streaming that here on the channel. Uh, besides that guys, thank you very much for watching and, uh, have a good one.